everyone a warm welcome to all of you and hope you're all doing well uh, today's uh, topic is uh, how the month of March 2021 will be for all Virgo ascendants or Virgo Lagna people as per Vedic astrology uh, if you have your birth chart and if the first house has the number six on it then this is for you uh, continue watching for those of you who do not have a birth chart and if you need uh, help with creating one, uh, please do reach out to me and I'll be happy to create a chart for you for free. All you need to provide me is with your date of birth, the exact uh, time of birth and uh, the place of birth of course. So without any delay, let's get into the video. Now, ruler of Virgo sign is Mercury as we all know. Uh, Mercury rules the ascendant, that is the first house, and it also rules the tenth house of profession. Now, Mercury is placed in the fifth house where number 10 is written in the chart, and it is sitting together. You will see that it's sitting together with Jupiter and Saturn. Now, on March 11th, Mercury will move into the next house, which is the sixth house in the chart where number 11 is written. Now, Mercury in the sixth house is generally considered very good. Now, Mercury this month will make sure that your overall health is uh, good. Uh, Mercury also will provide uh, full support in your profession. So your thinking will be clear and intelligent. And anything that you want to do this month, uh, you will do that intelligently. So nothing to worry about that. Now, when it comes to money and finance for all you Virgo ascendants, uh, your finance house is ruled by Venus and also the house of luck for you. Now, Venus, although combust in the sixth house, meaning when a planet is very close to the sun, that planet is called combust and it may end up not being able to deliver its full results. But the good news is Venus will move into the seventh house mid-March. So when it does, uh, Venus goes into a very good position called exaltation. Now meaning, Venus in the seventh house will give you very good results, be it in relationship with your spouse or partner or relationship with your business partners also. You will be able to enjoy all types of luxury and comfort. Your conjugal relationship with your spouse will be very good at least until mid-March. So students um, will be able to focus very well in their studies and they will enjoy good memory and can retain all that they have learned easily without any problems. Uh, this is due to Jupiter's position in the chart but Jupiter is sitting with Saturn as we all saw so Saturn will make sure that one will have to work double hard this month that especially students will have to work very hard it is through their hard work they will be able to achieve um, any good results now Sun is in the sixth house where number 11 is written Sun will give good results in the area of your work Saturn actually rules the sixth house. So Sun is considered the father of Saturn in Vedic astrology. And Sun does well in the sixth house generally. And Sun will ensure that your money and finance is good and the month in the month of March. Now Sun will move into the seventh house where Venus is after mid-March. Now Sun is considered to be mildly cruel planet and it may bring ego matters into the surface when it comes to dealing with your spouse or even in business partnerships but Venus being in the same house Venus is in a good position there so it will kind of balance it out or salvage the overall bad effect caused by the Sun and nothing to worry now overall your relationship with your spouse or business partnerships will be good in the month of March now we will talk about Mars in your chart for Virgo ascendants usually uh, Mars is not a favorable planet. Also, we see uh, Mars is sitting with Rahu, which may indicate that your father's health may be a bit of concern here. So Mars and Rahu together in the ninth house also indicates that you could sway a bit away from your religion or beliefs. Now, Moon is placed well in your chart this month and Moon will support you well in matters of finance and gain in your income this month. So, 
this was the overview of uh, the month of March for all Virgo Ascendants and uh, hope you have a beautiful month of March and with that I will end my video here. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that uh, any new videos I make, uh, you will be notified uh, immediately. Now, also if you need a consultation from me, uh, you may contact me at the email address uh, provided in the description box uh, below. So, thank you for watching and uh, bye for now.